the future you've been manifesting is going to be so much better than you've been imagining. You guys could be doing a lot of clearing. You guys are clearing away the old, some kind of energy is clearing. It's going to start, it's going to become easier and easier for you guys to let go of something that you've possibly been holding on to. Trust that your manifestations are going to come to you guys. There's some kind of shift or something like that. Archangel Shamia, number 20. Be what you want to attract. So you guys are attracting something. It's going to be better than you're thinking or imagining. You guys could have been going through some kind of rebirth or something like that before this happened. Or you had to go through some kind of rebirth. Maybe of your mind. Spirit says a rebirth of your mind had to take place first. You had to endure some kind of challenges first so that you could appreciate this. You're doing some kind of reset or a readjustment. You're refocusing or some kind of start or restart. Take action. Okay, they want me to pull from here, so you may have to take action on something. You need to believe that anything is possible. Sever vows of poverty and block out distractions. There may be something or some people trying to distract you from whatever this is. Sever vows of poverty. Dear one, there is no need to suffer or sacrifice. Hold the intention of undoing any vows of poverty or self-denial that you may have made consciously or unconsciously in any lifetime. As you do so, all effects of these vows will be undone for everyone involved in all directions of time. So you're clearing this energy out. You're clearing poverty out of your life. And you're blocking out distractions. Your life purpose and other priorities need your undivided attention. So it is time for you to take charge of your schedule and working environment by turning off all electronics and avoiding anyone or anything that distracts you from what's important. You already know what these distractions are and you have the power to responsibly block them out. So you're gonna need clear focus with whatever this is you've been manifesting. Anybody that's not aligned with this, you may have to block them out. new beginnings there's something about a new beginning here archangel jeremy starting a new life finding your purpose a forgiving and compassionate review of the past so this is this may be involving your life purpose or some life path you're possibly getting ready to become wealthy or um, very wealthy or even wealthier than you've been Yeah, there may be someone that you're involved with or that you know that they have some kind of bad vibes. You need to cut that out, block that out. <laughs> so 
spirit says one bad vibe and you're out you're you got to cut out some bad person or someone with some negative vibrations low vibrational person three of pentacles reversed is some other person or people that are not in in alignment with what you're trying to do they don't think how you do they're not trying to manifest the same thing you're trying to manifest possibly or whatever you're trying to attract these could be some people that was causing issues in your life or didn't want to see you doing better they didn't want you to sever vows of poverty they didn't want you to go down this path or something with this life purpose you're not you're not trying to work with whoever this is or team up with them or collaborate with them eight of swords reverse they were part of the problem and tower seven of swords reverse they was part of the problem this person was trying to keep you trapped or some people was trying to possibly could have been a group of people, maybe some friends. These could be people that you were overindulging with alcohol spirit says you caught them. They was trying to manipulate you. You could have gotten bad advice from these people. So you're, you're clearing out the energy with the tower, bringing the tower down. And now you're rebuilding your life or realigning yourself or reprogramming yourself or your mind or something like that. These people was like secretly doing some kind of deception. It was hidden or they tried to keep it hidden. These people could have wanted you to lose opportunities or lose your job. They was purposely wanted you in poverty. Now you're manifesting uh, financial security, financial wealth. You're manifesting something with material security. You're trying to be stable, financially stable, secure. Could be some kind of material desires or um, you're trying to own something. Spirit says that's why you cut them out of your life. Yeah, they was possibly jealous. Someone's going to be super mad, angry once they see you in this Ten of Pentacles or some of y'all, they have already seen you in this energy. Your wealth is stable. This could be something about a business or some businesses. Somebody's generating a lot of revenue or something like that from some businesses. Yeah, they're jealous of this fortune that you have, global fortune, about your, your luck changing, your destiny changing. You're, yeah, these people are possibly in poverty themselves or low vibrational. You're hanging out with a different group of people like or like, um, or like you're going to attract some other people. Yeah, some people that are uh, like-minded. Spirit says trust your vision. You need to trust your vision. Seven of Pentacles. You're making plans or you have some kind of vision for your future that you've been investing into. The hanged man. You're looking at these people differently. You've gotten the chance to see a different side or all sides of something. You could have been poor and um, had money, then poor again and had money. You're about to have money again or something. You're about to be in this Ten of Pentacles again. You could have been doing a lot of resting. You need to be thankful for whatever this is. Somebody's name could be William. Six of Pentacles reversed. Yeah, these people wanted to take from you or they wanted you to not have anything. They wanted your life off balance. 
It's like they wanted you in the Five of Pentacles energy, like deliberately. Spirit says you're going to figure it all out. You always have, you always will. You're going to figure it out. Yeah, there's a Five of Pentacles. You could be in this energy right now, temporarily. You're about to, you're about to stumble upon some kind of unexpected income. You guys could like garlic or something like that. Or something with some kind of garlic. This <laughs> is garlic. Somebody could be eating garlic right now watching this. Okay, you're going to get some kind of harmony or some kind of resolution from whatever this is. You're about to make something happen. You're about to make something happen. You're about to take action, expectation, great fortune. Yeah, you need to expect some kind of great fortune or for your situation to improve. Somebody is upset about this or they're going to be upset. Okay, so you, somebody's about to be driving around in a Bentley or something. You're about to be driving around in like a really luxurious type of car or vehicle or something like that. I'm also seeing some kind of van. I've seen like a Mercedes van. <laughs> somebody's about to be so pissed. Yeah, take action. There you go. There's action again. Take action on whatever that is. Whatever you got planned or whatever you're manifesting. They're about to be hated once they see you. You're going to have something to show. Somebody was trying to deceive you or some kind of deception. It was some kind of deception to have you in the five of pentacles. Now you're breaking out of that or you have recently broke out of that. Show us more Archangel Michael. Archangel Shamiel is here too. Yeah, you've ascended since then. Moon is Sagittarius. Optimism. Remain optimistic. You're getting help from the divine, from your angels. You have a whole bunch of angels watching over you, working with you. Don't worry about what nobody says. Don't worry about nobody's judgments about that. Yeah. <laughs> These angels are moving this person forward on these seahorses. Like, you have so much more. You, you have no idea. Like, you're about to be so blessed. This could be that energy where someone's about to be a multimillionaire and you're about to travel. These people have no freaking idea. Someone says, please say that it is not over between us. There's something about a gentleman. Somebody could be, you could be raising a gentleman. You could have a little son. You're trying to make sure he's raised into a gentleman or you're teaching your kids something. You're going to teach your kids something. Something about a gentleman or you're involved with a gentleman. Something about a gentleman. Spirits letting me know. Wow. They want to bring you everything that you've ever dreamed of. Yeah. Your spirit team is going to help you. Maybe someone else in the material world is trying to do this with you guys. I'm seeing somebody getting ready to stay at some kind of hotel. Spirit says Marriott. Wow. You're so irresistible to someone. You're irresistible, magnetic. They find you irreplaceable. Wow, yeah, you got good things coming up. You're educating yourself or you're getting educated, pursuing knowledge, becoming informed, increasing your understanding, studying, learning, seeking a deeper meaning or finding out more. So, you know, this could be some kind of education you're involved with, some schooling, education or some courses or something like that you're taking. You could be seeing 11-11 a lot. What else, Archangel Shamia, Archangel Michael? Transformation, joyous fun. Yeah, 
your whole life is about to transform. You have no idea. I know I'm repeating that, but it's like, I'm trying to express to you. You guys have no freaking idea. Like literally everything is about to work out in your favor. Everything's just about to be working out for you. You're about to have the greatest luck. Spirit says purify your life. Something about purify your life. You guys could be doing credit repair, repairing your credit. You're going to be having so much finance or money or something or your financial situation is going to change once you sever these vows of poverty clear out this poverty energy out of your life and once you block out distractions from these other people okay these are sticking together okay there's going to be some kind of negotiation entrepreneur loan approved you could be an entrepreneur or you get to your bet your your <laughs> the spirit says you bet okay you're getting ready to do some kind of entrepreneurial stuff or you are an entrepreneur some some kind of endeavors you need to take action on if you're going to be applying for a loan you're going to get approved and there's possibly going to be some kind of negotiation or you're going to meet and sit down with someone for some kind of deal. This could also be some kind of property deal is what I'm sensing. Something about some kind of records. You guys could have something with a record collection. You're going to be able to afford any clothes you desire, Spirit says. You're going to be able to afford any clothes you desire, any fashion, apparel that you desire. Yes, Spirit says stop dwelling. Stop dwelling on your loss. You had some kind of loss. You made a mistake or someone tricked you, manipulated you. These people caused you to have some loss or they caused you to be in poverty or they caused you to fear your security they've got you scared to move forward because they deceived you you had a loss of wealth or money or you lost a job possibly well, this is the ace of pentacles reversed you was going through some unlucky time or you lost resources or support there was a negative change you could have got demoted stop dwelling on that what's gone is gone what what happened has already happened Yeah, trust the process. Bear says trust the process. The will, Archangel Jeremiah, the will of fortune. You got to trust that this is coming through for you. There's a new beginning, end of delays, a change in direction that offers happiness. So it's your time to be happy. Wow. They're preparing you for something. Who are these other people? What this group or something? Three pentacles reversed. <laughs> Some people that you don't need to be effing around with, you're you they had you in regret. These people had you in regret. Know that you cannot change the past, just keep moving forward. You're not effing around with them no more. Yeah, they're about to be mad. Page of Wands reverse, Knight of Pentacles. You went through a tower based around them. They did something that brought a tower into your life. You had a fall or something. 
some jealous people. You're someone that works hard or you typically have a good work ethic. Wow. You've been hesitant and cautious with something, something new, or you're hesitant to take action with some new endeavor, maybe some new business plans, a new business endeavor, some new beginning or some course or training. You're new to something with, um, <clears throat> excuse me, you're new to something with some entrepreneurial stuff or something with loans or something with negotiations or credit, credit, credit repair. This could be a new job. This could be simple as a new job for some of you guys. But I feel like this is like um, you're going to be a boss, a leader. You're 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 going to be the boss. Like. You're thinking big, something with entrepreneur. OK, this could be two people. Two people or a couple. Two of cups. There's someone you're connected with. You have a strong connection with it doesn't have to be romantic it could but um there's this could be someone young this could be somebody younger than you helping you with something yeah they're helping you with something they're gonna tell you something or they recently did they're very smart intelligent this is somebody very informative very self-confident they're not afraid to take action they're not afraid to make bold moves or take risks you're feeling inspired by them you know it's going to set you on the right path spirit says yeah it's good stuff this is so good for you six of pentacles someone's helping you this person is going to help you get out of poverty and it's going to be a lot of fun. And you guys are going to be in the Ten of Pentacles possibly together or build a business together or some kind of negotiation together. Some kind of partnership or business partnership. 